Hello everyone. Today I want to show you how easy it is to build slide in animations in Swift UI. So I have a sample app here, and when I hit this button, a pop up will slide in, and when I hit OK to the pop up, it will slide out. I have already prepared a view here, a content view with a view model. And the content view is very simple. There is only one button, and when it's pressed, I call a method on the view model, deep tap on show pop up, which controls the visibility of the pop-up via a boolean. So whenever that method is triggered, inside an animation, I said should show pop-up to true. And then if that's true, in an overlay, we check if it's true, and if so, we call make pop-up in the content view. And the make pop-up is a pop-up view, which is a simple pop-up with a text and a button with some additional styling. And then of course, if the pop-up's OK button is tapped, we call the method on the view model again, and now we set the visibility to false. But as of now, this won't work with the sliding animation. So if you run this now, and if I hit show pop-up, it will appear from the center, and if I hit OK, it will disappear from the center. But with one line of code, we will be able to make it slide in from the bottom. So if I come to the make pop-up, and after I, we receive the view from the make pop-up method, we can call that transition and come here and say any transition that move an edge button. And if you run it again, now let's see how it will look like. So if I hit show pop-up now, it will come from the bottom, it will slide in from the bottom. And if you hit okay, it will slide out from the bottom as well. Any, any transition along with the transition has different methods. So you can also explore yourself, like there is this slide or opacity and more like scale. There are more interesting methods as well, but I will leave exploring those to you. So that's it for today's video. It's very easy to build sliding animations with SwiftUI, and I will see you next time.